Good morning. It's Sunday, July 11th, 2021, continuing my baseball episode series. Episode 26, Sam Crawford. I like the name Sam. I did Sam Rice in the previous episode. Sam Crawford, why? Old school. 1899-1917, 19 years. Why did I pick him? He can hit. He only hit 97 home runs in 19 years. 1,500 RBIs. Lifetime batting average, 309. Not as high as some of the other players. But he made the Hall of Fame... Why? He was a solid player. 2,500 games, 2,961 hits. What's going on with these players? Don't they realize they can become members of the 3,000 hit club if they just play a little longer? Sam Crawford, 2,961 hits, 39 away from 3,000. You know what's interesting about Sam is he is number one all time in triples. 309 triples in his career. What's going on with him? Did he have the speed? Let's see. He was six, six feet tall, 190 pounds. Why is he the guy that is number one in triples all time? 309. Maybe when he hit the ball in the gap, it just kept rolling and rolling, or he hit it over the center fielder's fence in these large ballparks. And he just rounded second and kept going to third. So I'm not going to focus on Sam Crawford's home run totals because the highest he had was 16. But I want to look more at his triples. Did you know that he had 20 or more triples in a season? One, two, three, four, five times. 20 or more and as high as 26 triples. He had more triples than doubles one season. 26 triples, 22 doubles. He had 458 doubles for his career. So let's get into his uh, stats year by year. 1899, 19 years old, 31 games, 307 batting average. 1900, playing for the Cincinnati Reds. 101 games. 260 batting average. Okay. But he gets going in 1901, 21 years old. 170 hits, 330 batting average. Here's what he does. 20 doubles, 16 triples, 16 home runs. Listen to this. 1900, he, he starts getting triples and double figures for the season. So he goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 years out of 19 years, he has double figures and triples. 15, 16, 22, 25, 16, 10, 16, 17, 16, 14, 19, 14, 21, 23, 26, 19, and 13. A triples machine. Mr. Triple, Sam Crawford. Okay. 1902 season. 185 hits, 333. 1903 season. 184 hits. 335. 1904 season, 254. 
He was down from 335. 1905 season, 297, 171 hits. 1906 season, down, 295 average. 1907, 188 hits. That's his high. 323 average. Okay. Nineteen oh eight. Hundred and eighty four hits three eleven. Nineteen oh nine. Three fourteen average with hundred and eighty five hits. Nineteen ten, one hundred and seventy hits, but he gets a hundred and twenty RBIs that season. In fact he went over a hundred RBIs one, two, three, four, five, six seasons. 120 RBIs in 1910, 289 average. All right, here's his best year. 1911, 654 at bats, 217 hits, 378 batting average. Three seventy-eight in nineteen eleven. He's thirty-one years old, so he's in his prime. Nineteen twelve, hundred and eighty-nine hits, three twenty-five average. Nineteen thirteen, hundred and ninety-three hits, three seventeen. Twenty-three triples. Nineteen fourteen season, four thirty-four years old, playing every game. Hundred and eighty-three hits. 314 average. 1915 season, 183 hits. He goes back to back 183 hit seasons. 280, 299. 1916, he's 36. 286 average. And then 1917 is last year, 37. He hangs it up also early instead of going to age 40. So 18 hits, 173 batting average. So how many times does Sam Crawford go over 300? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 times out of 19 years over 300. His high was 378. Also had 335, 333, 330, 325. Sam can hit. 2,500 games, 2,961 hits, 458 doubles, 309 triples, 97 home runs, 1,500 RBIs. Lifetime batting average, 309. I like Sam. Sam Rice and Sam Crawford. Old school player. Played for Cincinnati Reds, then he also played for the Detroit Tigers. Started at 19 and stopped at 37. Should have gone to 40 to get over 3,000 hits. But I'll take him on my team. Would you? Okay. <clears throat> All right, I've been focusing on um, old school players. Let's just throw in another player that was unique in his career let's go with Mel Ott is next thanks for watching I'm out